Hello class, good day. I hope you are all well. Welcome to our subject numerical methods and today we will talk about Gauss-Seidel method. Um, apparently, we should have this as a uh, live synchronous dis discussion but then the memo was given by the dean and dapat ito rin yung, uh, this should be our machine problem 4. But then, let me just uh, discuss this through how we can solve it using Microsoft Excel and how we can easily solve it. And I will just, I'll be just giving uh, practice problems in order for you to practice, okay? So, again, I hope you are all well and lagi kayo mag-iingat class. Nasa panalangin ko kayo sa araw-araw. So, ay, narinig nyo, no? Kumukulog na dito. So, mag-iingat kayo parate. Okay. Now, talking about this uh, example, okay? From the previous lecture or the lecture of Sir Jerome, we have solved this problem, right? So, we have identified X is about 0.75, 1.25, and J is, I forgot, but then, uh, essentially, the gauss Seidel will give us this. By just simply having the equation, okay, the gauss Seidel. ayun ba yan? Pangit naman, ayan. Okay, so the gauss Seidel is, simply rewrite the equation first, okay? And then take note again that this should be arranged diagonally dominant, okay? This should be arranged to such that it is already diagonally dominant, okay? If you don't know diagonally dominant yet, I want you to review your lectures, okay? I want you to review your lectures, so, what's the next step? So, let's identify the steps for Gauss Seidel. Uh, diagonally dominant, DD. Okay. Double damage. <laughs> and next is um, solve for the following. Solve for X, Y, and Z. Okay. Which in this case, we have already identified also. In this part. Okay. And then finally, iterate. Ganun lang kadali. Okay. We can easily uh, iterate already. Okay? Ay. Okay, so number three, iterate. So, in go side, we will always start at zero. We will always start at zero. So, iterate one, two, and three. What will be the, uh, what will be the value of this, guys, class? So, solving for x from this equation. Okay, from this equation. That will be simply equal to, but the value of y and z, what's the value of y and z? From the uh, row 10 or row at 0 iterate, iteration. Okay? At iteration 0, that will be your y and z. Okay? So that will be negative y, uh, parenthesis muna tayo. Negative y, this one, minus z. Right? Minus Z. Plus 3. Alright? And then divided by negative 2. Boom. Okay? Let me zoom in for you to uh, see properly. Okay? Next. How about for Y? This equation. Right? So that will be equal to... And then what will be the function of X and Z? X, X and Z. In this case, here. Negative... 2 multiplied by x, right? Minus 2 times z, right? That one. And then finally, plus 3. And then close all in parentheses, divided by negative 4. Boom! And then finally, solving for z, that, that will be, what will be the function of x and y from this one? From row 0. Or row 10, or iteration 0. That will be, close parenthesis again, negative 1, negative 1 multiplied by x, plus 1 multiplied by y, ay mali, <laughs> ito pala, okay, minus 7, parenthesis, divided by negative 2. Boom. Alright? 
So, this is my first iteration. And then, ganito na lang yan, class. You will just simply drag this down. All. Right? Until you find the uh, the values doesn't change anymore. See? So, I believe we have uh, about 23 iterations from the previous exercise in Ghost, Jac uh, Ghost Jacobian. There it is. In Ghost Seidel, it is earlier. About 20 iterations. Okay? So, my values for X, Y, and Z is simply the following. That will be this one. Base values. Boom. X, Y, and Z. So, that's it. I hope you learned something today, class. For the Ghost Seidel. Stay tuned for our, our upcoming machine problems and my announcement regarding our programming C++. Uh, Nagahanap pa kami ni Sir Ken ng mga legit sources in order for us to download legally. Okay, legally. And that will be it. But silently, if you will have any questions, comment down in this video or message me in Facebook or in my email address. God bless you all, class, and I miss you all. Always take care. And that is go, uh, go sidel for our subject numerical solutions. God bless you all. Bye bye.